The militant group has said, it would not use force after it laid siege to the capital on Sunday, a political agreement between the Taliban, and Afghan politicians is being discussed, but it comes at a price. The Taliban entered Kabul on Sunday without facing any resistance from the government forces, the militant group is now effectively in control of most of Afghanistan, Taliban negotiators are reportedly holding talks with the Afghan government to facilitate a transfer of power. A Taliban spokesman said on Sunday, the group wants President Ashraf Ghani and other Afghan leaders to work on the transition of power, the Afghan government confirmed the negotiations were underway to avoid bloodshed in Kabul. Interior Minister Abdul Sattar Mirzakwal said, there would be no attack on the city, and that a peaceful transfer of power to the transitional government was in the works. Ahamdi Saidi, a former Afghan diplomat, told DW, he is hopeful that Ghani's administration, and the Taliban will agree on a peaceful transfer of power in the coming days, the government does not have any other option but to hand over power to the Taliban, he said. But there is still a possibility, albeit remote, that Afghan politicians in Kabul will try to hold on to power, in that case, the Islamists could try to take over Kabul from Afghan forces by force, if the Taliban attack Kabul, there will be bloodshed, more civilians will lose their lives, and Afghanistan will face an uncertain future, Azad said. Stay tuned for the latest news.